Hey there, Unapologetic Posse. It is Sonia Renee, and I am feeling crazy, terrified, and nervous, and excited, and don't know what to do um, about this crazy vlog that I'm doing right now and what I'm about to share with you guys. Uh, so basically, I have decided, I just made up this thing, and I want you all to follow along with me, and it is called a ruckus. Uh, and Ruckus stands for Radically Unapologetic Healing Challenge for Us. Um, and so I'm inviting all of you all to create your own Ruckus, your Radically Unapologetic Healing Challenge um, for us. And the us part is for us to follow and learn from each other and heal from each other as we all go through these individual things. And so... Um, uh, for the body is not an apology I have decided that I need to do some sort of radically unapologetic healing for myself um, around some of my biggest body issues and uh, the one that has been in existence for the longest time is um, shame deep deep shame around my hair uh, if you many of you know me from the poetry world and you know that I am the queen of fabulous wigs. I have 10 billion of them. And I love them. And I love being able to play dress up and be a different person every time. Um, but the truth is that underneath those wigs is a whole lot of hair shame. Um, and we'll talk a little bit more about all of that and how it came along. And the things that I've done to deal with it. Um, as we go through um, this radically unapologetic healing challenge um, for the next 30 days and so uh, for the ruckus project ruckus project um, I'm gonna create ruckus by doing something that I never thought I would do um, which is that I'm going to shave my hair tomorrow at 7 p.m. I'm having a shaving ceremony at my house I'm gonna have people that I love deeply come um, and they're all gonna contribute to shaving off the hair on my head and I'm going to be bald. Um, now I know many of you right now are saying, well, so what, Sonya? You can always just put back on your wig. Well, I am not going to put back on my wig. I am committed to at least living 30 days bald with no hair on my head. Um, and like I said, I'm totally terrified about the prospect, but I believe that um, this is the type of ruckus I need to create in my life um, in order to really heal and get rid of some of those um, energetic ties related to my hair. And so it is officially 20, it's not even 20, because um, tomorrow at midnight would be 24 hours, and I'm going to do it seven hours before that, so maybe we're around 17 hours before this shaving ceremony. Um, and so what I'm going to do is I'm going to blog every day um, for the next 30 days and talk about my process in this ruckus project um, and talk about uh, the historical stuff that comes up for me and share with you guys uh, how this uh, healing journey is going to go. Um, and so uh, this is the first installment of my ruckus project, Radically Unapologetic healing challenge for us um, and I'm super excited about it the first thing that I'm going to do tonight which is the first step in my ruckus project is that I am going to unveil my natural hair since it won't be on my head as of tomorrow at 7 p.m. Um, and so uh, that's what we're gonna watch right now uh, okay so, basically, um, this is just a little scarf that I put on, and underneath this, I'm terrified, uh, is Sonya's natural hair, ah, uh, craziness. So right now, it's in two tr strand twists, and then I had those two strand twists braided, and so you've got crinkly little two strand twists all over my head, like <laughs> crazy little two strand twists. Um, so we will talk a little bit more about my hair and where my issues lie with it um, as we go along. But I feel like that the first process is to unveil the hair. Um, 
tomorrow there will be no hair it'll just be my big bald scalp um thank you guys for taking this journey with me I'm terrified but I'm gonna do it because I believe that there's healing in it and I encourage you all to go to bed tonight or wake up tomorrow and think about your ruckus project what is it that you need radical unapologetic healing from around your body and what's what can you do to create that um, and then I encourage you to follow me and let's do it together let's create ruckus in our lives and heal and love ourselves and empower ourselves and each other um, to feel as beautiful and profound and important as we really are on this planet uh, so I'll catch you guys tomorrow <laughs> Good night.